Hi there, just thought to say hello. This is a new project I'm doing, which is uh, 18 slabs. So, 18 shades of timber. And uh, there's more slabs over there. And this is more of the stuff that I've already done. Um, put it all together and put it into like a three-dimensional shape. Um, so it sticks out the wall with all different, sh like... Not different colours so much, but different colours if in the, in the aspect of different shades of the same colours. So I'm using in this project white, blue, green, yellow and purple. Now, they're not my favourite colours, but they go well in what I do. So that's why I'm doing it. Um, there's an exhibition coming soon as well, so keep your eyes out on that on the Facebook and Twitter. And of course, follow me on Pedro Perez Art. And I'll show you around, there's a few more stuff here. So, we've got other paintings I've done recently. This being uh, one of my favourites recently, and uh, it's quite a big painting I did. It's still wet because it's oil on it. And we've got some more paintings. So we carry on going around here. We've got, we've got this one that's quite new. This one here. And then we've got this one that's already been sold to my friend Jack Moran. And this one that's very popular. So here we go then, we're going to swap around to these paintings here. Now this is the project I'm doing at the moment. Now, when I, um, when this is dry, so like there, that's dry, yeah? I then add some varnish to it to give it a bit of a coating, to make it stand out a bit. Because when it's on the wall, it won't stand out unless it's got this on it, because it, the shades of different colours on the timber might make it a bit plain, and I want it to look more three-dimensional. So, before I add the varnish, I add some of this. Now, people are thinking, why would I add that? Well, when you're decorating on a wall, if it's from a normal decorating house, you normally do put matte or gloss, depending on what you want to do with it. But I find that matte on wood, especially timber, is then like makes the oil I use and the gouache a little bit more subtle and a little bit more like smooth. And then when you add the varnish on the bottom of it, perfect. So, that's the project and there's a lot of stuff coming. So keep an eye out. Thank you for listening. Thank you. Mm-hmm. <laughs>